And this dynamic on your teams happens every single day. In every organiza organization in the world, do you know this? This is called triangulation. This happens in every group of people in the universe. And you know how it goes, right? You tell me if this happens on your team. Person A and person B have a problem, you know, which could be a big problem. They don't like each other. Or a little thing like, how could you leave the fries in for 10 seconds longer than they should, right? Which is a big thing. Or it's, hey, you called me by the wrong name. Or you, you know, whatever. It could be a little thing or a big thing, right? And person A and person B have, have a little disagreement with each other. Who does person B go find? Darn right. Because we, as humans, we go find then the other person. And oftentimes, we find the person that we know is going to agree with us, right? And so we go find person C. And person C, as you know this already, because you've experienced it, whether you've thought about it this way or not, plays an enormous role in the culture that gets created in that one little interaction. And my guess is, because you're in this room, that you oftentimes, and you're a leader, you often find yourself in the role of person C quite often. Is that an amen? Yeah? Because you have people on your team coming to you. Guess what person A said? Person B said this, blah, 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 right? And person C in every organization, every group of people on the planet plays an enormous role in setting a temperature for how things are going to be handled. And it usually goes one of two ways. The first way is person C just basically like throws gasoline on the fire, right? <laughs> Thermostat leaders, they take it a different direction because this will, this will always happen. It's not, will this stop? This will always happen. But as person C, when they come to you and they say, can you believe what person A did? Blah, 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 blah. Person C takes a deep breath. Steps back and listens. And absorbs it. And say, I'm sorry that you're feeling that way. I can see how you must be frustrated. I understand this must be hard. I'm so sorry you're feeling this way. And they absorb it, and they listen, and they care, and they think about it. But then at the end of the conversation, what they do is they say, you know what? This sounds like this is the problem you're talking about is between you and person A. And as your friend and your support and your leader, it sounds like we need to work this out between you and person A. And so I want you... I'm encouraging you to go have that conversation with them. If you need my help, I'll sit in with it. And I'm going to check back with you in a week and see how that went. 